एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू पार्ट थ्री ऑफ आवर गूगल डिजिटल क्लाउड क्वेश्चन एंड आंसर सीरीज टूडे वी विल कवर फिफ्टीन इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन टू बूस्ट योर एग्जाम प्रिपरेशन लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट इट एन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन हैज एन ई कॉमर्स अप्लीकेशन दैट रिक्वायर्स अ कॉस्ट इफेक्टिव ट्रांजेक्शनल डेटा बेस द अप्लीकेशन विल ओनली सर्व कस्टमर्स इन अ सिंगल रीजन विच सर्विस शुड दे यूज एंड ऑप्शन आर क्लाउड स्पैनर क्लाउड एसक्यूएल बिग क्वेरी क्लाउड बिग टेबल एंड द आंसर इज क्लाउड एसक्यूएल सो क्लाउड एसक्यूएल इज बेस्ड फॉर सिंगल रीजन एंड इट्स कॉस्ट इफेक्टिव एंड ट्रांजेक्शनल वर्क लोड्स लेट्स मूव टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन एन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन इज डेवलपिंग अ न्यू कंटेनर बेस्ड अप्लीकेशन दे डो नॉट नो हाउ पॉपुलर द अप्लीकेशन विल बी वेन लॉन्च एंड दे डो नॉट वॉन्ट टू पे फॉर आइडल इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर रिसोर्सेस which benefit of serverless computing will address this concern and options are reduce development cost disaster recovery built in security scalability and the answer is scalability so scalability is automatically adjust resources based on demand let's move to the next question a manufacturing organization has a large collection of images labeled as intact or defective parts they want to use this data to build a simple solution to detect faulty parts on their production line they have no data science expertise which solution should they use and the options are auto ml document ai pretend apis discovery ai for retails and the answer is auto ml auto ml allows custom ml models without coding expertise Let's move to the next question. A cinema company wants to build a model to predict customer visits pattern for the coming year. They have three years of customer visit data across three hundred theaters. However, the data has been stored in different formats by different theaters. They must train the ML model. What should they do? And the options are. use the last year of data so there are fewer inconsistencies for the model to handle choose an ml model type that can process different format of input data transform the data into a consistent format group different format type and train a different model for each group and the answer is transform the data into a consistent format let's move to the next question an organization is running critical workloads in production and requires a google cloud support service with fast response time and a dedicated technical account manager which customer care service level should the organization choose and the options are basic enhanced standard or premium and the answer is premium premium includes tam and highs sla let's move to the next questions an organization runs a batch data analysis workload on a virtual machine the workload can be easily restart without losing work and it's not time critical organization must choose the lowest cost option to run the workload what option should they use and the options are primitive or spot vm on compute engine standard vm in pay as you go model on compute engine a custom vm in a pay as you go model on compute engine a cloud function with a small memory limit and the answer is a primitive or spot vm on compute engine this is the cheapest option let's move to the next question an organization is evaluating its defenses against cyber security threats and is concerned about the risks of social engineering by cyber criminals how might this attacks happen and the options are distributed denial of service attacks sql injection attacks physical damage to hardware phishing emails and the answer is phishing emails phishing email is an most common social engineering method let's move to the next question an organization has migrated several large databases to the cloud it wants to increase the value of its data improve cost control and strengthen regularity compliance what should the organization do and the options are export relational data to modern nosql database 
delayed data stored for over a year, create monthly reports on data access and uses, establish an effective data governance program. And the answer is establish an effective data governance program. Let's move to the next question. An organization is developing application by using Kubernetes. They want their team to spend more time developing rather than managing clusters. Which Google Cloud service should the organization choose? And the options are Cloud Run, GKE Autopilot, Compute Engine, GKE Standard. And the answer is GKE Autopilot. Let's move to the next question. An organization processes batch sales data at the end of every month to analyze sales trends and derive businesses insight. They want to improve accuracy and make near real-time decisions. What should the organization do? The options are filter the data so reports are generated laser, process batch reports weekly instead of monthly, change from relational database to a NoSQL database, switch from batch processing to stream processing and the answer is switch from batch processing to stream processing let's move to the next question an organization is using new technology to change its business processes and culture to develop new customer experiences and adapt to market dynamic what is the name of the approach and the options are user personalization digital transformation operations optimization data center migration and the answer is digital transformation let's move to the next question a financial organization has many customers who close their accounts every year the organization wants to use data and ai to identify at risk customers so they can retain customers by offering discounts and improve services what should the organization do and the options are Create a survey for all customers to identify their current level of satisfaction. Create a dashboard of previous customers that have exited and look for obvious correlation in the visualization. Create an ML model based on the demographic and activities of previous customers that exited. Create a report based on last year's customer feedback. And the answer is create an ML model based on the demographic and activities of previous customers that exited. Let's move to the next question. What is the site reliability engineering terms for an organization desired level of reliability and performance? And the options are service level objective, enhanced support, scalable infrastructure, service level indicator. And the answer is service level objective. Let's move to the next question. An organization is deciding on the layout of their resources hierarchy in Google Cloud. They have several projects within a folder. What will happen when user access policies are applied to the folder? And the options are the policy will be applied to all folders within the organization. The policy will be inherited by the projects and their resources with the folder. The policy applies to the folder only and will not be inherited by any projects the policy will be inherited by the projects in the folder but will not affect their resources and the answer is the policy will be inherited by the projects and their resources within the folder let's move to the last question an organization is hosting an application in europe and customer in asia are reporting slow response time despite their fast internet connection what is the problem and the options are network latency not enough application servers misconfigured application servers network bandwidth and the answer is network latency that's all for part three of our cloud digital leader question and answer series if you found this helpful like the video subscribe for more exam preparation and check out our part one and part two in the description see you in the next one